So if you're trying to figure out where the government is, the U.S. government, as it relates to regulating crypto, uh, this is a very good video for you. I'm going to make it very short, very to the point, and tell you right here, right now, the seven things that you should know about the uh, Biden's administration to um, their executive order that's coming up. Okay, so that's what we're going to talk about in this video. As always, I truly appreciate you. Thank you for your support of myself, my channel, and my videos. Here we go. All right, so I'm going to scroll right here to the bottom because these are the seven things right here. So you should know seven important things about the upcoming Joe Biden executive order on cryptocurrency. Number one, President Biden is preparing an executive order to set policies and regulate digital assets in the United States. So regulation is coming in one way or the other. It is. Don't shoot the messenger, okay? I firmly believe that the regulation is going to really Im impact three scenarios. Number one, I think that they're going to regulate stable coins. I think that's going to happen. Number two, I think that they are going to put together a policy related to trying to protect people from uh, rug pulls, uh, you know, things like that. Um, number three, I think that they are going to regulate and put into place, obviously, the taxation of crypto profits. That is going to happen. Okay, I think that those are the main areas of what this is going to look like. Are they going to outlaw crypto in the United States? No, I, I firmly don't believe that's going to happen. If you look at the countries that have outlawed crypto or trying to, who are they? China, uh, Russia. Those are the main ones. Enough said, right? Okay. So as far as this executive order on crypto, it is expected to be released as early as February. Okay, that's number two scenario. Number three, there are no specific details yet right here, right now. Okay. Uh, the Biden administration uh, has shown that they are serious about regulating the industry as officials see the asset class as a means used by criminals to finance illicit activities. I, I hate this little piece of content. It's why it's why I read it out because I wanted to give you my opinion. This always comes up. Well, what about dollar? What about what about hard? What about fiat money, currency? That's used in illicit activities. <laughs> I mean, it is. You know, so. I wish that that the media would move away from this particular um, scenario. You know, if you look at China and Russia, they always kind of point to that. Hey, it's used to launder money, and this is like a. I mean, yeah, it is, but it's also used for a lot of good, and you, and they never really mention that. They always want to throw that little. Hey, it's used. It's used by criminals in illicit activities. Come on, guys, can't we move on from this point of this point of discussion? I mean, you know, physical physical currency is used for illicit activities. All right, you can tell this one's that one. I'm, uh, that one I'm just tired of hearing about, which is why I wanted to talk about it. Okay, number four, federal agencies will be directed to discuss the risks and opportunities posed by cryptocurrencies. So that's one thing in this in this executive order coming from the Biden administration is that they're going to basically be looking. Um, you know, it will be um, tasking. Um, guide and getting guidance from the from the SEC, the Commodities Future Trading Commission, and the Office of the Comptroller of Currency in a bid to develop the executive order. These are different large um, organizations here in the United States. You know the SEC, um, the Community say that really fast. The Communities Futures Trading Commission and Office of the Comptroller of the Currency. That's, I mean, like literally say that really fast. It's like the OCC. Um, these are the different kind of governing bodies in the United States as it relates to, you know, monetary policies and monetary uh, things like that. Okay. So that's, uh, what are we on? Five, I believe. Um, so another thing is that, I don't know if you know this, is that uh, senior officials of Joe Biden's administration have met several times to discuss and finalize details. There are some very strong advocates for crypto uh, who are senators and things of that and, and, and congressmen and congresswomen uh, or ladies or congressmen, congresspeople, <laughs> excuse me, um, you know, that are out there that are that are uh, working on this as well that have uh, that are very strong advocates. So we'll see how that plays out. And I think that ultimately, you know, we need to continue to have a voice and hopefully crypto has a strong enough voice. Um, but here's the other thing I would tell you is that crypto is that is that there was a piece of content I, I was reading yesterday it was talking about the fact that the, because there is regulation coming into play it's a situation where um, you know crypto's kind of gotten too big to ignore for for the for the uh, for the government if you will 
and regulation in one way or the other was always uh, coming. Okay, and then finally, the executive order will put the White House at the center stage of regulating crypto in the uh, in the U.S. Well, that makes sense because that obviously is kind of how it usually plays out. So this is where we're at. These are the seven things that we know right now. I gave you my opinion on the main areas that I think are going to be um, managed in this. I think it's going to be stable coins. It's going to be profits. They're going to tax profits. And um, and I think that they're trying to figure out how to protect people really not from the quote illicit activities, but I think more from protect people investors from like you know rug pulls and things like that and i think that that's a good thing and so uh, the last one mainly the taxation of profits was always going to happen it's always going to come it's been in the stock market forever i've been used to it over there you're going to alter you, you are going to owe you know taxes on profits and again don't shoot the messenger I'm just bringing you the info i'll see you later thank you for your support